Appalachian Trail parking at Route 56 at the base of Priest Mountain and the trail heads right up behind this sign here going southbound and northbound is right across the street uh, or is it I think it's over there somewhere and there's a really cool footbridge we're gonna go check out that read your guide it's a 3,000 foot elevation gain with 36 switchbacks. This is just north of the parking at Route 56 and there's a really cool bridge here that I'm going to go check out. Let's work our way down here. Ooh, there's some sun. And it's actually pretty neat. It's like a skinny suspension bridge. Go check this out. All right, off we go to the priest shelter. part of the trail is really nice. It's been raining a ton, so it's kind of green and moist. You can hear the river in the background. It's really full. It's rushing fast. The sign says it's about 4.7 miles to the priest shelter. It's a little further than I had guesstimated. But that's okay. Got plenty of time. Pennsylvania, <laughs> there's no rocks. It's so nice with no rocks. It's super steep coming up this trail right from the parking lot, a lot of switchbacks. And as a section hiker, I'm not used to that. So I'm getting a little out of breath. I hope it's not too much further. Okay, I've said it before and I'll say it again. Gap is a four letter word. Okay, it's still going up and up and up and up. No, the crossing's a little bit goofy this spot. I'm afraid I might get wet. Uh. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Tag awesome sauce. So this was definitely worth the struggle to get up here. It was all uphill. Boy, that view's awesome. GPS says it's about a mile and a half to the shelter, so I'm expecting it to be maybe a little bit further than that as the trail bends. Should get me there before it gets dark, which is good. 
and maybe on the other side of this ridge I'll catch some sunset. Okay, I underestimated by a lot how long it was going to take to get here and how hard it was going to be. The priest kicked my butt. It was uphill the entire way going southbound. Not one dip down. It was awful. So I'm going to get my water. Thank God there's water here. Camo up. Set my tent and go to sleep. So one of the things I forgot to do was look at the guide before I did this hike. And when you hike from Route 56 up the Priest, that's a 3,000 foot climb. And I think there's 36 switchbacks and it's just relentless. It goes up and up and up. And the shelter's right over the top. So the good news is tomorrow will be all back down. Lesson learned, read the guide. This is the spring behind the priest shelter. It's running really, really well. I don't know how well it runs when it's dry, but when it's wet, it is cranking. There's the shelter right there. One of the neat things about the priest shelter is the guest book is basically a confessional, which I thought was kind of interesting. Must be because the name of the shelter is the priest. Everybody thinks they have to confess their AT sins. It was dark last night when I got in, but back in here there's actually a lot of nice tent sites. It's out in front of the shelter. A whole slew of them in here. These are nice and flat. Along this ridge there are little campsites and fire rings and views out by these rocks. Oh yeah. Another totally amazing view.